Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It's been a little while since we've uploaded any GTA content to this channel, but today we got a question from a viewer named Jutes Gleis or something like that. But boom bash, this guy is from Europe. He asked a question and I'm gonna answer. How do we play the mission Satellite Communications because he is level 67 and he cannot find it? Now, you could do it the traditional way like we did in the when we first got the game. Hit your contacts up, call up your contacts, and ask them for a job when you give them the call. So here you go, calling Ron, blah 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 blah, and we're gonna ask him, can we please get a job, Ron? He's gonna be like, yeah, bro, no problem, I'll get you a job. But you guys all know that this job that you get is completely random and out of your control. Um, and there's the mission we got, landing gear. I don't want to play landing gear, I want to play something else, such as satellite communications. So here's how you do it, you hit pause, go to the online tab, there will be a thing that says jobs right here. Hit jobs, you're gonna want to host your job. And then you're gonna go and go down to Rockstar Creative. Now you can choose death matches, races, captured, last team standing missions, versus parachuting and survivals, given that you are the level to play them. As long as you are the level to play them, um, there will be it'll be available for you here, and you can check what rank it opens at. It says 65 for this mission. Um, the check marks next to them says you have played them, but basically every mission that you have unlocked will be right here and for you to play on demand when you want it. So the mission this guy asked for was satellite communications right there, level 60, Vinewood Hills. And you don't have to call Ron or keep calling your contacts to find the mission. You can just pick what you want to play and that goes for everything here. So go ahead and if you want to start the job, you're going to click A on it. It's going to ask, are you sure? Because apparently we're not sure. Go ahead and tell it, yes, I am sure that I want to play this mission. Uh, your council is going to stop working for like two seconds and then it's going to bring you to this menu where you can control the radio that everybody listens to, pick the difficulty of the job, uh, pick your starting weapon, ammo, purchase all ammo, armor, and confirm your settings. Once your settings are confirmed, invite people or play by yourself because I'm just that lonely. Yeah, sad truth of life. Anyway, it's going to go ahead and create the session. Keep in mind, you're going to spawn wherever you started the job, so we started the job in my garage. Uh, from there, you're going to go ahead, we're going to be in the mission, and it's going to go ahead and prompt you to do as the mission requires. So as for this mission, it's going to ask me to steal the trailer, which is up in Vinewood Hills. Uh, we're not going to go ahead and do the whole mission, but that's how you get the mission. Uh, if you do not want to play the mission some way through it, you're like, I don't want to play this. Uh, you have two options. You can hold down the D-pad, scroll back into single player, or... Uh, you can pause the game like some people do, go to online, go ahead and click find new session and you're going to go ahead and quit the job immediately and it's immediately going to take you back into free room. So there you guys have it, that's how to play any mission you want at any time in the game. I'm pretty sure most of you guys knew it but just in case for a couple of you guys who haven't, who haven't heard about this or are having a hard time finding the job that they want, this is how you do it. This goes, like I said, for deathmatches, races, survivals, uh, missions, and everything else that you could possibly want to do. So there you guys have it. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, subscribe to the channel, like the video, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Hopefully you guys will stick around for the channel because, uh, you know, it'd be nice. It's nice to have you as a viewer. Oh, by the way, if you have a question on Grand Theft Auto Online or something like that, go ahead and leave it in a comment section of any video or this video and I will be sure to respond to it to the best of my possible ability and if I can I'll make a video on it too. So what's your loss? If you have a question go ahead and ask it in the section down below and I will answer your question for you. Hope this helped and I'll see you guys later. Bye guys.